Hello everyone and welcome um, to my first video on my channel. Um, it's going to be reviewing um, the first episode of Season 7 of the Clone Wars. I know I'm kind of a really weak late, but um, uh, we need to create the shell and stuff. So I'm going to be reviewing the first episode of the Clone Wars Season 7. Um, so this was um, a very exciting episode. This um, episode was actually like released like back like a few years ago um, when the clone was finished because there was like unfinished episodes. They were released to like YouTube and stuff, so I kind of already seen it. But there is a few changes. Um, it's been a long time since I've seen those unfinished episodes because I, um, you know, I, I don't watch those unfinished episodes all the time, but I do watch the Clone Wars TV show a lot, and I'm really gl glad we have season seven now because mm. it's now new content for us. Like the Mandalorian, the Mandalorian has shown that like, yeah, TV shows yeah. do work and make Disney a lot of money, so we're going to see a lot more of these. Um, yeah. So in this episode, I guess, like, um, you know, um, we're going to brag about? into the Clone Wars and we're introduced with this on? thing that the clones, you know, they're learning the clones' tactics, you know, they need to do something different. Yes, exactly. They need to vary their tactics, so they get this, um... Um, these this batch of clones, the bad batch, and they're like um, super clones basically, and they're like prototypes, and I guess they never made them again for some reason. I don't know. And you know they have different tactics to the normal clones. They just rush in and uh, it works, but they're like really quite powerful. And but the clone, but the usual clones, they just have to they have to outsmart the droids. Um, they have to try a bit harder. So you know these um two. Different types of personalities that the phones have to like um, blend with each other, and um, although the storyline has been done before, um, I'm glad we got it again. Um, yeah, I, I'm glad we got it again. Although it is only going to be 12 episodes in the Clone Wars TV show, I am still happy because this is a very good episode. I like it. I I, I want I I do want to see more of these clones. You know, um, I um. I don't know how they'd make. I, I, um, it's not gonna be very long. I mean, I mean, I like. I don't want these clones to go on like a five, five or six season run like the Clone Wars did. But I do want to see more of them. Like, um, I want. To, like, we are, we're of course going to get a few more episodes of them and stuff. Um, so yeah, I am. Um, I do like them. It was like you've seen them before, where um, Rex is just looking back at all the um, older clones. There's like, um, and he thinks that, um, oh, I forgot which one he thought was alive. Um, wow. Yeah, I think he's crazy. Think, think he's crazy. Yeah, so, um, he th thought Echo was alive. Um, at the end of the episode, it actually revealed that I think Echo is alive. So we'll see that in the next episode. I'm very excited for this. Actually, I probably should have watched this episode before making this review, but, um, yeah, I'm very excited. Um, the Mandalorian arc is um, going to blend in with this, like, um, from the trailers, you know, we've seen a lot of that. And we actually, in the trailer, we see, like, um, Anakin and a pregnant version of Padme that teases that actually I might be going into a bit of an episode three after um, the Battle of Coruscant, which there might be an episode about that. Like, my, like, there might, like... Maybe at the last episode, the Mandalorian arc might just like at the end of it, like te they just like show a few clips, like the 2003 um, mini series. It did like I don't know, it, it did some, it, it was doing something. I don't watch that series that much, but then and then like it said that. So basically, Obi Wan and Anakin were on a mission, and Jan Palpatine got killed. Uh, captured, cap <laughs> he, he got captured, and then like Obi Wan and Anakin were uh, notified about that, and then they did like a big like like a two second scene about like the um, Battle of Coruscant. Just you just look at that and just like then you go into Episode Three. So I hope it's at the same as this. Like um, we see the see the, um, I don't know like Episode Eight of this season maybe. See the last of the of the Mandalorian arc. Then we get to see maybe a bit at the end of the episode about like Papa can get trap captures, and then Obi Wan and I can have to go and rescue him at the end, kind of like the 2003 miniseries. So that will definitely be me 
very exciting to see. I'm not really reviewing the episode anymore, but I'm just saying. And then I might go into, um, a few episodes might go into the middle of episode 3, because like, there's a 9 month period maybe, because um, Padme preg- just announced pregnant at the beginning of the film, and then at the end of the film she gives birth. And I think the Order 66 scene like takes place like overnight, so yeah. But then again, Padme, I- I'm sure Anakin and Obi-Wan have been away for like a few months, so maybe Padme was, was already pregnant in a few months. Um, so yeah. Um, this is so, yeah, <laughs> um, this is unscripted, and I, I really, I, I really think, I really wish I part of this out as well. Yeah, I really love this episode, um, there's, I think, I think there's, like, two of the Bad Batch that really stick out to me, um, well, there's the leader, um, there's Wrecker, who is definitely my favourite, I love him, I love, he, he, um, I think, like, Cody gets injured in the battle, and, like, and Rex is like, I'll get him out, but no, Wrecker is just like, no, I'll do this. And he just lifts up the whole ship by itself, and he, like, but without any, without any uh, struggle, he just pulls it out, and it's really cool. He's also a smart one. <laughs> I don't know his name. He's, he's, he's smart. So yeah, guys, just test this episode, and I am really excited to review the next episode, which is coming out tomorrow, so I will definitely be reviewing that. That might um, be better, because... Um, I'll just be after watching the episode. Of course, I have it playing in the background here. Um, yeah, I'm definitely looking forward to this. I did um, cut in the middle of so the, the um, rest of the season. Um, that's because this is just not what I usually do. But I, I'm very excited to start this YouTube channel and to make a lot of videos about the Star Wars franchise and stuff. Even some things that you might not know, like the holiday special. So I'll see you in the next, guys. So, I'm, I'm saying the next.